And uh, I pretty much um, want to talk about like a uh, turning point and uh, my iPod. My iPod symbolizes me because uh, it has, has a lot of different songs and a lot of different, you know, uh, artists and music, not just rap or, or R&B or just, it has everything I can think of. Um, my, my, uh, throughout my life, I've had many different people and come through my life and teach me life lessons and how to be a young man and how to grow up and persevere through things in my life. Not having a father and growing up in a single parent home has been difficult for me, but I've learned to cope with it and, you know, mature and get over it and look at my mom as like a woman to me who I should take care of. I came here to play football because you know, growing up, like through high school, I didn't really have an outlet because I was always in, in some kind of trouble. But I found football my sophomore year. I started playing. I recognized I was good at it. A lot of people told me, you can do something with it. I necessarily could have made something at a Division One college or go here to Washington or Oregon. But I messed up with grades, so that's why I'm really here. I mean, it's not bad to me. It's just another outlet to <coughs> get through and make it somewhere and be something. I mean, I'm still getting to learn and meet new people. And it's just another step to the next level. For me, uh, football is pretty much my, my uh, like my object. I didn't bring it with me. I don't, I don't really have one. It's pretty funny. But, uh, I mean, football really, really helped me throughout, throughout, my, throughout my high school years. And it's the reason why I wanted to push to get by to graduate. And graduating was another turning point in my, in my high school. When I was a sophomore, my, my counselor, specifically told me I wouldn't graduate and there's no way for me to graduate. She wouldn't help me. She she put me in elective class, like five elective classes mm -hmm. my senior year and like one English class or something, you know? And it's like, you know, for all the people who ever thought of thought of me not making it or not going somewhere or doing something, I wanna prove that wrong. And not to throw it back at them to, to one day show somebody who's in my, my situation that they can do it too, or if they're down, or if they feel like they can't make it, you can always make it. And that's one thing I, I, I pride on is that never give up. Thank you.